What's going on, folks? Daryl Williams, or as I like to be called, the Iron Man. So today, we're going to talk about building up your forearms. I got a few grips here. There's four of them. Yes, believe it or not, you actually need four of them to be able to build them up. So, what makes these grips so special, they're made by a company called Monster Grips. They go up to 350 pounds. The only way you're going to build any type of grip strength is by challenging yourself. Don't go get a lightweight one that's, what, 10 pounds of pressure and then squeeze it a thousand times and figure that you're going to have a greater handshake the next day. It's not going to happen, okay? So, I'm going to go over a small routine here, just kind of a gist of it to get you guys an idea of the only way to be able to build good forearms. So, let me uh, get rid of some of these heavier ones. You want to start off with a 100-pound grip. Like I said, monster grip, solid steel. I mean, these things practically last a lifetime. I haven't failed one yet. Knock on wood, but very good stuff. So you want to start with your hand facing inwards towards your body, squeezing 15 reps as a warm-up set. Make sure that you hear it click. If it doesn't close, then you might need to stay with this weight for a little while and just practice with that, and then move on to um, the, the scheme I'm going to tell you here in a moment. So you want to do that for about 15 reps. Rest for about a minute. Next set, want your hand facing upwards. 15 reps, it's just a few warm-up sets. Third set, hand facing inwards again, you get the point. So, after you do that, of course you want to switch hands, work both hands equally, that's the only way to do it. You will go into a heavier weight. So, this one's a 200, I'm just using it for demonstration purposes, because normally I use the 250. So, you want to build up your closed grip strength. That's what really builds up the forearms as heavy weight, okay? So, if you have to use two hands, use two hands. Close it as far as you possibly can with both hands, and then hold it. Breathe. You want your hand facing inwards towards your body. Now you're only going to do two sets of this, okay? Hold it as long as you possibly can, and then let it go. Obviously, if you can't hold it anymore, rest for about a minute. Then you want to do it again with your hand facing upwards. Squeeze it, hold it for as long as you can, breathe in, breathe out. Really focus on trying to close it all the way, holding it, and then let it go. Simple as that. You do this for about 6 to 12 weeks, and you'll notice your forearm is going to be a hell of a lot huge, I mean, a hell of a lot bigger, rather. <laughs> all right, tune in next time, you guys.